Hello there, guys and gals! Welcome back to yet another... It's, I mean, it's sort of a 100% achievement guide, but it is title update season, and it is still in full swing. And this time, it is one step after fall, and once again, it is a very, very another easy couple of minutes uh, extra thousand that we can grab for, you know, walking around, picking stuff up, and being like, hey, here's my 1,000 extra dollars, man. Or, you know, if, uh, you know, too long, didn't read. One step after fall, new title update in what is proclaimed to be title update season. Easy three-minute completion. So there we go. Job done. Um, now, if you have already played the base game, you will pretty much know how this works, how the buttons are. Uh, you can sprint or slightly jog faster with the left bumper. Pick items up with the right trigger. Use the left trigger to go into your inventory, and um, then use the right trigger again to use said item in your inventory. Uh, but again, all we're doing is picking up a few things. So, as we begin, we can head straight forward. Again, press the left bumper to jog slightly. And we're going to get our first achievement straight away here for watching the crows fly. When I see a crow fly, it makes me hair pale. And then what we're going to do is just head straight for the uh, little building here in front of us. We need to press the right trigger here on the door, and he's going to be like, Oh yes, how could I forget that people lock doors? Immediately go to the left, and we're going to head up this little windmill, or this little grassy path up to the windmill. And we can see a couple of steps here. We are going to take a step. One, two, three, four, five, six. Grab the key. Again, right trigger, then right trigger again to take it. Then head back down. If you want to jump and see if you can, I don't know, you know, take some damage or something, that's up to you. One step after damage fall. Yeah, anyway, go back to the door, press the left trigger to get your inventory, then the right trigger to use the key, then the right trigger again to open up the door. Head to the back, to the table, interact with this Polaroid here, right next to this moldy looking pieces of bread. That will get us the Polaroid achievement. So you can press the left trigger there to put it back. Then we can head back outside. From here, we're going to turn slightly left and just uh, basically go through the woods. Now, if you remember, we need to uh, we need to basically find the tower through the first game. Uh, from the first game, from the base game. So, head all the way through the woods, and the tower will be directly in front of us. Uh, before heading up, what we are going to do is interact with and go through the door on the bottom here. Head left ever so slightly into the back of the room, and there's going to be one wine bottle. Old Campos Aroni's wine bottle. It's the, it's the tastiest $4 bottle on the planet, I, I'd assume. Anyway, that'll get you the Campos achievement. So we can head out, head to the left here, and then go around to find the ladder. I went to the right for some reason, so I'll just, uh, yeah, sorry about that. Apparently, I still get confused my right and left. Uh, use the right trigger, of course, to climb the ladder. Go around, press the right trigger again to climb up this ladder. And again, you can press the left bumper to sprint, or somehow climb faster going up a ladder than you can actually walk in, slash jog in. Anyway, once we are up, there is going to be one book here on the right-hand side box that we are going to interact with. There, that one is. So pick that up. Carol's Depression, that doesn't sound like a very, uh, that sounds like a depressive read. Anyway, be careful here. Don't fall off. Remember to just take your time, then press the right trigger to go back down the ladder. And then we've only just got one more book left to grab. And it's basically, it. what, what it does, it basically involves us just walking in a straight line until we find the other barn. So, when we drop down here, again, we're effectively now going in a straight line. So, back through the woods. Feels like we're going on a bear hunt here. Going on a bear hunt. Back through the woods. Past the dock and lake on the left-hand side. And, oh, just in the distance is the safety from the bear. Or, in our case, it is the barn that we are after. Once we go left into the barn, the book called... Alienicity, or whatever it is actually called, will be on this hay bale in front of us. There it is. Press the right trigger to pick it up. You can take it if you want. Job done. You crap your pants, because aliens are there. And that is job done. So, another easy title update, all done and dusted. So thank you so much for watching, guys and gals. I hope you enjoyed this one. I hope the guide helped as well. If you did, of course, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share it with a friend as usual. And I will see you in the next game. Big love.